guys I am back again with another tutorial and in this tutorial I will be doing my friend's nail and as you can see right now I am filing down her natural nails and then in the next clip you will see I'm pushing back her nail cuticles with the cuticle pusher As you can see right now, I'm using the e-filer to remove the oils from her natural nail so that the acrylic and the glue may stick to her nail. from each nail I would then put the nail dehydrator on her nail to make sure that there's no oil on her nail at all as you can see I am measuring each nail tip just to make sure I have the right nail tip and if it Basically, you always have to make sure if it's too small, go to the next level where it's bigger than the nail and then just file it down a little bit. After measuring and gluing down each nail tip, I will then file down the nail to her shape and she wanted it long this time. to the shape that she wanted I made sure that I used the e-filer to blend the nail tip with her natural nail you can also do this with the regular nail filer <laughs> see today I am doing the ombre nail technique where she wants the white tip and the nude color at the bottom near her cuticles and as you can see I am brushing down the white acrylic first towards the tip and then I would then push my brush back backwards towards so it could blend with her natural nail and then so when I put on my pink nude color on top 
there isn't a harsh line between the white and the nude. she wanted it to be a glitter like the whole nail glitter so as you can see I had you basically to get that design I put the brush into dip the brush into the monomer and then dip the brush into the clear acrylic powder and then dip that same brush into the glitter just to be able to get that stickiness of the glitter so it could stay on the nail <laughs> see I am applying the pink nude color at her cuticle so it can blend in with the white and I'm gently brushing it on do not brush it too hard so it doesn't come too forward on the nail unless that is the basically the design you want to do After you are done with each nail, you would then encapsulate your designs with the clear acrylic powder. See, I am fouling the nail once again after encapsulating each nail to make sure I get that shape back how I had it at the beginning. Yeah. have to make sure that there is no acrylic on her cuticles near her cuticle on her skin and make sure that you blend in that acrylic near her cuticle so it doesn't lift and your nail doesn't pop off easily After filing each nail, I would then buff her nails and after buffing her nails, I would make sure that she wash her hands and after she wash her hands, I will apply the no wipe gel top coat nail polish. <laughs> After letting her nails dry for 30 seconds, I would then apply the cuticle oil that she has in her hand. And as you can see, her nail is done.